First on Fox 9, COVID cases are returning to concerning levels in the St. Louis region. Task force hospitals say they are starting to fill back up. Fox 2's Zara Barker talked with county leaders and doctors tonight, and they have a message for the community. Seems like a roller coaster, to be honest with. As mitigation efforts and restrictions are relaxed, the St. Louis region is dealing with its first spike since the vaccine has become widely available. St. Louis County Executive Sam Page says COVID cases in St. Louis County are up almost 65%, and he's concerned. We're certainly all disappointed to be facing another wave of this pandemic. Dr. Page says there's only one solution. The vaccinations are effective, and they're safe, and they're free, and they're easily accessible. And this is the only way we're going to stop the surge that's coming. The St. Louis Metro Pandemic Task Force is reporting hospital capacity at a 92% average and ICUs at 81%. And that's not all. Nearly every number the task force tracks is increasing. New hospital admissions went from 32 to 42. COVID positive hospital patients increased as well from 213 to 222. Since the beginning of July, ICU beds and patients on ventilators have more than doubled. 13 people have died from COVID in the last three days. We haven't seen that many deaths in a three-day span in more than three months. This vaccine gave us hope. We are open again. And now I'm scared again because the spike in the cases has... I was thinking, are we going to have to put tent outside the ER again? Dr. Muhammad Malik with SSM Health says this wave came because of a more contagious Delta variant and a spike after 4th of July. To eradicate this, to stop this, get vaccinated. Do you foresee any restrictions coming back? Well, I, I hope not. Um, we, uh, we're watching the cases grow. Currently, our hospitals are able to manage. But not every hospital in the Show Me State can. The hospitals in southwest Missouri are overwhelmed and they are starting to send their patients to Kansas City and St. Louis. In St. Louis, Zara Barker, Fox 2 News.